Hi, welcome to my YouTube channel, The IT Profession. Today we will learn how to install and configure Apache Web Server on CentOS 7. You can use the same step on uh, RHL 8 also and CentOS 8 and uh, CentOS 7 also. Okay. Uh, here I am already list the package, the HTTPD that is uh, I have already installed uh, for the time durations. So the package is installed successfully on this machine. This is CentOS 8. You can check uh, the version of this machine. But I the command get space forward slash it is forward slash red hat dash release. Okay. The CentOS release is 8.5. Uh, that is the community version of uh, Red Hat Windows. Can say, okay. Uh, I've already uh, enabled the firewall. Uh, to check the firewall, uh, type the command system ctl space status space firewall d. Here firewall is running, and uh, to check the ports of firewall, type the command firewall dash cmd space dash, dash list dash ports okay here you see uh, i am already enabled firewall for port 80 for tcb and port 40 for tcb okay um, after that when you install the apache web server that is the apache web server default page will be open on the web page uh, this is the article also if you want to learn uh, in depth how to install and configure Apache web server you must read my article on my website learnitprofession.com here, uh, here I already written an article about it and here you see the complete steps how to install and configure Apache web server so, okay. to check the web server uh, you need to type the uh, IP addresses on the website on the web browser sorry uh, to check the IP type the command IP space dash in. here the IP is uh, 192.168.10.224 at the IP 192.168.10.224 here see the default web page is working fine uh, if you want to, uh, to open the web server by use of full qualified domain name in a domain environment uh, you need to do multiple steps on httpd.conf file also and uh, as well create an uh, if you want to carry uh, for a test, test demo you need to create also a html file on a default location and any other location so here i am creating a, a web page on a default location so first we need to move or uh, you can say the rename the file name of welcome th this page this page to rename it so the page is available on httpd etc httpd for slash con dot d directory then its name is welcome okay if you want uh, I, I, am I am rename the web page with the name of welcome dot con that bkp the page is renamed right now. If you want to refresh the page, the page, the web page is not working. Uh, in uh, you must need to check in com. 192.168.10.2. No, you need to restart the service as well also. System CTS base restart base HD. Restarting the service of Apache Web Server. It's taking a two bit long time. Okay, now let's try that way. You see that the page is not working right now. Uh, okay, now. After that, uh, 
some configuration uh, some configuration step need to be performed on httpd.com file by use of bi editor type the command bi is the forward slash etc forward slash httpd forward slash conf because httpd file available on conf directory not conf.d conf.d uh, directly uh, uh, you can create a virtual host also and welcome dot uh, welcome page available also there so on conf.d directory conf directory uh, go to the file httpd.conf if you want to uh, check the file uh, or you can say uh, view the file with the numbers press shift colon then type se space n okay okay first uh, i am showing you you need to change the email address of server admin if you want that uh, if uh, the client machine uh, or you can say the client you uh, client receive an error on the web server the web uh, this email address is showing on the web page then he or she will send an email to on this email address that they are facing the error so that's why this email address is important to configure on httpd.com file okay for insert press insert then change the email address and type the email address uh, for example two ways at the rate uh, pakistan.local1 that's my domain name ok next is to configure a uh, server name this is if you want to open a server with a domain name not with the IP so need to configure the domain name but with the IP the server will also open but to configure full uh, if you want to configure full qualified domain name you need to give the server name yeah. I am giving a server name for example this is uh, lamp my server name is lamp because this is a default my uh, uh, default web server you can say default website that's why I am using a server name otherwise you will need to configure virtual host okay to lamp this is a server name server name is lamp dot pakistan dot local okay this is a server name colon port ID if you uh, want to give the port 443 you need to uh, you also need to create a csr then create a certificate from the certificate authority uh, windows also provide a certificate authority so you can create a certificate in an environment from there okay next is to configure on line number 148 allow options follow same link okay line number go to line number 48 you uh, you can go to line number 48 directly by press cap to leave it insert then type shift colon and type the line number 148 okay this is uh, here the follow same link is available on line number 147 okay here you just need to remove the indexes so again press insert and remove indexes okay and the next step is to um, allow override all on line number 155 go to line number 155 press scale again press shift colon type line number 155 uh, it is available on line number 154 remove none then type allow override all then you need to provide a uh, index pages name that is index.html index.php index.cgi so go to line number 167 press cap 
press shift colon then type line number 167 here uh, directory index is available index.html by default if you provide more indexes with a name like index.php and index.cgi you need to type to here so again press insert type index dot php and index dot cgi okay the last configuration on httpd.com file for this demo scenario is uh, you need to provide a server response header so go to the uh, end of the file by press shift g then press for insert press uh, insert press enter you see no more line after that so type server response header press enter again shift hash type server response header for comment press enter the server response header is server tokens space prod server token tokens space prod save to save the file press escape then type colon by shift colon uh, by sh uh, and then wp for save the file Q means right, Q means root, quit the file. Present there. Okay. After that, you need to restart the Apache service by type the command system ctl with restart with http to check the file is giving an error or not. The service restarted successfully. To check the status, type the command system ctl with status. Split HTTPD. Here you see the server config and listing on port 80. Now you need to create a file on a default directory. If you want to create on another directory, you need to create it, but must need to provide the path on httpd.conf file. So here I am creating an index.html file for demo purpose and index.html. Then press enter, press insert, then copy the code, press get then save the file okay now again uh, you can again restart the service but uh, no need to restart here because this is a port so for, for the safe side i am restarted to waste the time to don't waste the time so just uh, check the web server is working on the code here you see the code is working and the, the web page is open but if you want to check this web page for the FQDN means full qualified domain name in a domain environment, you need to create a the host record. Here the host record is creating against the IP 192.168.10.226 because my uh, server name is lamp. So, lamp dash centos it. Okay, the server name is lamp dash centos it. So I so am create a host record here on domain name pakistan.local1 lamp dash send to a state against the IP. The IP of my server is 192.168.10.224. Okay. Before create the uh, host record, I am showing you a web page is working or not. Here you see the web is working but when i type the url lamp dash send dot uh, pakistan dot local one the web page will not be here you see the web page is uh, cannot be displayed but when i create the host record the web page will open successfully Okay, the host record created done. Here you see the host record is created to check the web page open or not. Press refresh the page. 
okay what is the error mm. lambda sum cosine dot plus lambda dot plus lambda okay uh, on file I am uh, giving the host name on http.conf file I am giving a host name lamb I need to give the host name lamb dash sent host it yeah insert lamb dash send host it to save the play file press cap then call in wq restart the apache web service ok now need to check the web page is working with the host name or not refresh again ok uh, after restart uh, apache service and verifying some configuration but i have not changed any configurations uh, but uh, after restart the Apache web service, the web page is open. You will see the lambda sent to say dot Pakistan dot local one is open. But I have verified some configurations on httpd.com file, but nothing to change. If you want to ch check with me, uh, I should, I'm showing you that there is uh, this. space and you and nothing to change see the code is less than 80 and the user apache is group apache server admin email address is this server name is lamb dash and dot uh, dot pakistan dot local one for an 80 and nothing to change from here and also I'm going to line number 148 that is option for assembling and line number 154 allow or write call and uh, line number 167 that is in that dot and that and that's for cj and go to the end of the line end of the file uh, shift g that is servers tokens default that is the whole configuration of uh, apache httpd.com file and uh, also i have uh, created dns post record on uh, you see the uh, lambda centos 8 is also joined with an ad if you want to see my authentication video you must view on my youtube channel and uh, i've created also a dns record lambda centos 8 with against the ip 192.168.222 i've just uh, reboot the machines that's that is the whole thing i faced that uh, after that uh, the web page is open but in linux no report is required but if you face this kind of issue the web page is not open against the full qualified domain name uh, you can reboot the machine so here i'm only reboot the machine after that i've checked the web page open against my full qualified domain name that is lamb and i only written on the file HTML file that is pakistan thank you so much for watching this video to learn how to install and configure apache web server on centos 8 you can use the same step on rhl 8 red 8 red 7 and centos 7 and you can also use this step on the red 9 also and thank you so much for watching this video if you like this video please subscribe my channel and comment for more videos i hope you learn from it thank you Please like and comment on videos and subscribe our channel Learn IT Profession for receive new videos notifications.